my first guest tonight, a terrific actor, an award-winning actor. His new show, Partners, airs Mondays on FX. Take a look at this. Kelsey Grabber, everybody, Kelsey. <laughs> My dear boy. How are you, man? You know, I'm pretty good. How are you doing? I'm really great. You look very like a sort of rich dude. <laughs> you know, like well, linen and kind I look like a guy that was once really rich. <laughs> and things have just gone okay. <laughs> <laughs> ah, you're all right. You look yeah, great. I'm I like your great. Jack lavender jacket. That's it's a, good. It's a fabulous color. It's yeah, do you have someone hand. that chooses your socks for you by any chance? No, I don't. I, I saw your socks before and they're fantastic. Thanks. They're actually tights. <laughs> are they? I shouldn't. All the way should, up to oh, here. All the way up to here, yeah. <laughs> no, it's good. How is how's things going for you? I believe congratulations are in order. Yes, congratulations are in order. Um, Another? Uh, a, blessed, a blessed new grammarian is... Uh, well, so how many, how many is that now, then? Six. Six children. Six children. You're not wealthy at all anymore, uh, are you? <laughs> well, I figure, My God. I figure there is an obligation to make sure they're well cared for. Yeah, well, um, yeah. You, the you, trust fund. you're going to be working the rest of your I life. Have to. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but that's good. That's good. It's yeah. kind of like, uh, oh, man, I don't know if I could do another one, though. No. Yeah. Newborn in the house. Two, that's enough. Yeah. 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 No, actually, I like it. I kind of thrive on it. Really? I, I enjoy that young energy around and watching them discover the world. It makes me, you know, I don't what get about the What about the, uh, the utter lack of sleep for about three years? I'm okay beginning? with it. Really? Well, there was a time in my life when I didn't sleep at all for other reasons. Wow, well, me too, uh, yes. So but that seemed to be much more refreshing. fun, yeah. It was more fun. It reminds me of a story. You know, a coach uh, on Cheers was played by an actor named Nick Colasano. Right, yes. He'd been sober for a long time, and George Wen asked him once in the back of a car, said, uh, Nick, you know, when was the last time, you, you, have you, are you having fun? And he said, oh, hell, I haven't had fun since I stopped drinking. <laughs> yeah. So uh, this, uh, this show with, uh, with Martin, then, you're, yep. uh, you're, uh, he's uh, neat and you're tidy, or is that the... Uh... Uh, it's actually just, it's just odd couple, yeah, but it's odd couple updated. We're both lawyers, and uh, we have different um, um, approaches to the law. Right. I'm more of a liar. He's more of a, 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 a truth teller. Well, see, right there, that's your plot problem that's there. He's a lawyer yeah. and he's telling the truth. Yeah. 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 <laughs> that's going to be hard uh, to make that work. So he can't make any money, and I do. So right. together we become a rather potent team, and it's, it's been pretty funny. We'll he's, see what he, happens. He's pretty yeah. funny. You're a pretty funny he's guy. A funny he's a pretty guy. funny guy. That should work out. Yeah. And what's the network, FX? FX. That's the one they're all going for now. Yeah, it seems to be having... Well, well me, anyway. <laughs> <laughs> nah, nah. You know, I'm, I'm finishing here. I know, and, and yeah. you want to do a game show, right? I am, yeah, yeah, sure, yeah. yeah, yeah. I've already Congrats. started it, actually. That's a lot, of, a lot of, you know, buckaroos in that. A lot of green in that. <laughs> That's a, lot of, a lot of, you know... There's Snickerdoodles? A lot of snickerdoodles? <laughs> Call them both not, not, if it works out, yeah. If it works but, out. Yeah, if it go, works yeah. out. But there's no money right away. Yeah, it's yeah. kind of like, it's like a reasonably odds lottery ticket. You used to be on Drew Carey's show, right? Yeah, I did, yeah. Yeah, well, I mean, Drew ended up in that world for a while. He I think did, he did really yeah, well. he's doing the prices right. He's been there for... Drew and I... Do you know, I actually met you once when right, I was... backstage at Conan. No, I met you there. Yeah. But even before that, when I was... You probably don't remember this. We get... Uh, it was in an... <laughs> Maybe not. No, no. Oh, yeah, because you were like, <laughs> ah! Uh, no, no. <laughs> This is a true story. It was one of my first interviews uh, when, I, when I was on the Drew Carey show. Yeah. It was the CNN building on oh, uh, yeah, Sunset. Yeah, right, right. I was up there doing Larry King then. Right, because yeah, we, right. we go up, we get in the elevator, and you were very nice. And you said hello, and I said, oh, Kelsey Grammer, very nice to meet you. And you were like, yeah, and you were very kind to me. And we get up to the level, and the receptionist was there, and I said, please, you first. And Kelsey went over and said, uh, Kelsey Grammer for Larry King. And they went, oh, right away. And then they said, and you, sir? And I went, Craig Ferguson for Space Ghost. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> and, but the thing is, did you ever, did you ever get interviewed by Space Ghost? Never did. I tell you what, that Space Ghost show was hilarious. Something. Oh, man, that was a great show. And Larry, of course, Larry still interviewed still everybody. It, yeah. yeah it's pretty amazing, yeah. yeah. Yeah, how long has he been? Like over 75, 80 years. years. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, yeah, yeah. Do you ever see any of the old Cheers gang? Once in a while, yeah. uh, I'll bump into John Ratzenberger. 
Yeah, so I've he, seen him he's made some snickerdoodles with the... Uh, Snickers with his, the, yeah, his own little show, Made in America, I think. Yeah, yeah, and also the, uh, the what do you call and it? that other thing. The Pixar, he's always in the Pixar all movies. All the Pixar yeah. movies. Yeah. And I think he did that um, environmentally friendly packing material. You're kidding me. I think he may be like one of the guys behind that, so... He also did a movie called um, uh, Space Buddies, which is for very young children. I've not seen that. Well, you will. I will. Yeah, you're going to see it again. <laughs> Yeah, he yeah. plays the... Uh, Watching all the old classics. Yeah, <laughs> you'll be back back to Teletubbies one more time. There you go. <laughs> yeah. yeah, it's Little Einsteins right now. Oh, yeah, that's, yeah, that's the Little the Einsteins. One, yeah. yeah, yeah, oh, God. <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> I, no, I, env I, I envy you. I admire you. I don't Thank know you. that I envy you, you for doing it again. You I, know what? I'm in a position where I'm actually very happy with what I'm... Yeah, no, I, 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 I totally buy it. I don't... I just... Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I just, I'm just. There are people I'm, around me saying you must be insane, but. Uh, oh. Crikey, did go. Kelsey. Crikey. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. No, I. You can't let other people. Exactly. With Here's how you should live your life from their basement. Oh. Ooh la la. Man. You know. No, you don't need to listen. Do to not anybody. read the comments. No, <laughs> never read the comments. No. And and it's it's really. Are you on the Tweety or the? I I just I just sort of re-entered that world. I tried it for a while, about four or five years ago, and I uh, had some guy. Kind of tweeting for me, and, right? And that's not in the spirit he was, of he it. Was no, just Kelsey. making a lot of passes at women. That <laughs> I went. Oh well, actually, then that's this. fine. Yeah. My my wife saw it and she said, "What is this? Who's this girl from Australia in the Valentine outfit?" And uh, I said, "I actually do not know." And and the only way I could actually uh, confirm that was by showing her the tweets that had gone out and how bad the spelling was. <laughs> Because I don't spell bad. Right. And uh, bad, badly. No, no. Uh. <laughs> but <laughs> I'm such a crikey, man. I'm <laughs> sorry. But that would be poorly. Oh, poorly. Yeah, <laughs> yeah it would be. Yeah. So this last, I've, I've re-entered the the stream a little bit to kind of have some fun about uh, grammar and and. Uh, the misuse of language in our, our current way of communicating with each other, and uh, it's had some success, and it's, it's it caused you a get people of stir. Get, people get very angry about the wrong yeah, but, you know, period no or anger. comma. It doesn't you know. matter. It doesn't have to be angry. It's just, they were angry before they ever even exactly. heard of you. Yeah, they were exactly. just angry. It's just an angry place. Yeah, it is. It is. But so it's it's actually to garner a little bit of attention toward the uh, the new show. So. Well, people do use yeah. that the social media it's for that. It's, it's all right. It's all. Right. It is okay. It's all right. <laughs> We have to take a commercial break. Okay. Which is one of the things uh, that CBS almost insists on. Oh, okay. We'll be right back. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Oh, no. Look at the... Whoa, we're just talking. Yeah. So, uh, anyway, there you are. We're out of time. Okay. It's good to see you. I love well, your snake. Well, thanks very much indeed. It's a, it's a Freudian thing, you know. Uh, yeah. Well, it's a rattlesnake. It's a big snake. snake. It's a big, it's a big, big snake, snake to compensate. Rattlesnake. You know, it's funny. This reminds me of a story. Oh, okay. Oh. Good-o. Um... There's, there's a woman that's been working in my home for, oh, 30 years or so. And, of course, you know, once in a while, living in California, you end up finding rattlesnakes in odd places in your property. And By um, property, you don't mean your pants or anything. No, no. Yeah. That's always been a problem, but now, <laughs> no, they're usually outside the slacks. But, uh... <laughs> I like to think I live outside the slacks, Kelsey. <laughs> I was walking home up, the, up the, the pathway to my house, this is several years ago, and a girl named Elizabeth, who was working with the baby at the time, said, be careful, there's a big snake up there. I said, okay. So I started to walk up, and she said, Maria's taking care of it. Oh, uh, okay. Which either meant she had a machete out and she's gonna chop its head off. <laughs> or was actually shoot it along. Oh, I oh, thought what, it meant taking care of it, like... What she was actually doing was... <laughs> This kind of thing. Really? That? And the snake was completely out. And she said, there are some women from my country. Hypnotized uh, snakes? That know how to do this. She was one of them. <laughs> <laughs> so, needless to say, Maria is still with us. Sure. 
is never leaving. <laughs> you, want to, you want to know where that woman is at all times, yeah. <laughs> well, I, I think we all learned something. Kelsey Grammer, everybody. <laughs> all right.